guys are back to another vlog. You guys are having a good day. If, you're, if you are new to the channel, make sure you go on there, smash the subscribe button as well. Also, leave a like as well because I appreciate that a lot. So close to like 300 subscribers right now. I'm just going to go on Netflix right now, watch a movie, some scary movies. I've been watching a lot of scary movies recently and I'm really enjoying them. Today's me a good day. It's like 3 o'clock right now and I'm just chilling. I'm just relaxing. I've not got college today, but I've got college tomorrow, Tuesday. I've only got English maths tomorrow, but I've got a maths test tomorrow, so wish me luck for that. Don't know when this video is going to go up. I don't know, but it'll go up in a few days. If you have something um, like to talk about in this video, you'll probably tell by the title on the thumbnail, but it's something about my health and stuff, so... I know it's not the best video, I, video ever, but it is my life, and it, I think it is very, very important, and I do want to tell you. Some of you might already know what it is. Obviously, both to tell by the title on the thumbnail, but some of you guys might not know what it is, and I know that I had it, but uh, yeah, I want to talk about it later on in the video, so stay tuned. I might do my film about two or three days in my one video, so I vlog today. Now I carry on filming in the next few days as well and edit it and upload it as well. I'm just watching the, watching the film, guys. It's a very, very good film. Now I'm just gonna, now I'm just here playing some Fortnite. I'm gonna get into a game right now, guys. Um, yes, yeah, finish watching the film. It's a very, very good film. It's on Netflix. It's called He's Out There. It's very, very good. A little bit complicated at some parts, but it's a very, very good film. I recommend watching it if you're into horror films and stuff like that. So I start right now. I've had my light off just for the effect of watching horror film and stuff. Turn my light on now, guys. I might vlog tomorrow as well. You know, two days in one vlog. I've done it before, so I might do it again. But yeah, guys, it's, I'm, I'm just chilling out right now. I might film, I might, I'll probably film the rest of the vlog tomorrow. Now, guys, about to go into a game of Fortnite, some solos, try and get a win. I'm level 37 now, guys, I'm level 30 on season 7. Yeah, it's going good so far. Uh, it's day two, but it's Tuesday today. I vlogged yesterday, I'm vlogging today as well. And um, this video, I'm talking about diabetes, what I've got. Um, I know some of you guys might know that I've got that. You don't. I don't know if you guys know that I've got that, but you know, I'm going to talk about it today in depth. And um, yeah, some of, you, some of you might already know. Some of my friends are watching this video right now. Hi, but um, yeah, it's a you know, it's about my health. I've had it for like six years now, but I'll get into talk for it. Talk. I'll talk about it later on as well. Um, but yeah, kind of nervous to talk about this because this might like change what you guys think about me or. I don't know, I don't really want to say it, but like, it's my life and I feel like I should just say it. And this is my vlog channel, you know, this is my life and, uh, yeah, it's just important that I tell you and get it out there. Beautiful day, it's really sunny, cloudy outside. And I've got college today, I've got English, maths, I've got a maths test today. Uh, so wish me luck on that, because I really hope I do well on that. It's just a little test, not like the big, like, GCSE test what I'm getting soon, but uh, it's just a little test to see where I am, what groups and things like that. And today is a beautiful, sunny day. I don't know if you guys can tell, but I've actually got a cold. Got it yesterday, last night. I'm really annoyed that I got a cold. Like, my sound weird, my voice, I don't know, I just look, I just look, ugh, I just look tired and just look drained. Uh, but it's still going with the vlog, it's crazy. The grind is real, grind never stops. Um, obviously, I don't do daily anymore. But I'm thinking, guys, guys, if you guys like me to do daily vlogs for a week, um, then leave a like. And also leave a comment as well, because I love to do daily vlogs. Bring them back for a week or two. Maybe not when I've got college, but maybe I'll do it when the next holiday is, when we're off for like half term or something, or like a break. Yeah, today's, today's video is an important one. Um, but yeah, it's not going to be that interesting, it's not going to be that entertaining. But it's just going to be me sat down or talking about my diabetes. Um, if you guys don't know what, di don't know what diabetes is, I could explain it, it's kind of complicated, it's kind of hard for me to explain, I'll be here for a while talking about it, but, so it's better, probably better for you to go, for you to go online and type in diabetes and what it is. I've actually got type 1, type in diabetes, type 1 on Google, and come up what it is, but I'm going to talk about my life and what's happened with diabetes and my struggles and everything with it, so. So I've had diabetes for like 5 or 6 years now, I don't, I've had it for quite a long time, and I had it like as soon as I was, as soon as I was born, it's like it was in my genes, and I was, we were just waiting for it to come out, like for me to be diagnosed with it if that makes sense um so i've had it in me for a while and then I, when i was like 14 or 13 12 like that something like that um it came out you know it it just takes time just decides to when to come out and um, that makes sense <laughs> you've had diabetes like five six years now it's hard i'm not gonna lie it's hard it is hard to cope with and um, especially for college and everything like that and stress and keeping my blood sugars like normal like in the middle not high, not low, but also keeping blood sugars, you know, like stable. I've just had my breakfast, my toast, that's got carbs in it, that's like bread. So that's very, very good to keep me, keep my blood sugars like up there, but also like in the range, like five, four to five or something like that. And obviously when I'm low, when I've got like, like my number like three or two, I add like sugar, like Google tablets or Haribo, something like that, just keep my numbers, get my numbers up. And I don't know if you guys remember from this vlog. I actually had a severe, you know, severe hypo with diabetes, you know, I've got type 1 diabetes, you may or may not know, 
uh, and it's very, very severe high pain, it's very crazy. Went to the Greek like doctors, like the nearest one near us, um, and they sorted me out. I was still I had high blood sugars, and my numbers were not very good back then. And then I settled down, I was fine. And then a day after that, a few days after that, I went back home, um, and then, um, and then I think Tuesday, I think Tuesday afternoon or something like that. Tuesday afternoon, yeah. I had another hypo, I think it was a hypo or a hypo, I'm not sure. Basically it was very severe and I woke up, well, I was on my laptop, close to my, I can't use, I can't use my phone because my phone had water damage, my phone was just broken. So I was in my bed, watching some YouTube on my laptop as you do, Tuesday afternoon, you know, just chilling out, relaxing. I couldn't vlog really because like, um, my phone had water damage and this camera's not as great for vlogging, for vlogging because the quality's not as good. Anyway. Um, and then Tuesday afternoon, my mum found me, well, I was actually in my bed, um, I was actually like droopy, I was like, I was like that, my chin, my, my, my like cheeks were like sobbing like that, <laughs> I know it's crazy, very, very scary experience, and I just thought I'd say this, because like, this is my life, my vlog, my, you know, I'm sharing my life with you every day, very scary, I, I, a and &E came in, well, not A&E, sorry, um, ambulance came up to our house, paramedics came to our bedroom, sorted me out, Sold me some sugar. Um, my mum was actually on the phone to the operator whilst ambulance were driving over to our, over to our house. And mum, my mum was on the phone to the operator talking about like what I should do, or what, what my mum should give me, like sugar, because I was having a very, very bad hypo. And yeah, mum made this like water, like sugar paste, with like sugar and water, and stir it together, it makes like sugar paste. She put that around my mouth to make me go, my numbers go back up again. This is basically a thing. It's like a Bluetooth like technology thing attached to my arm, which basically tells me my blood sugar number number right now, which is 9.2, and that's like the time at the bottom, and like that's the number that means it's high. And this is the thing attached to my arm. It's like this like monitor like attached to my arm. I remember waking up in like middle of the night in the hospital, the nurses coming, doctors coming in, asking me questions, and uh, also you know there were lunar injections on me giving me antibiotics, giving me ear drops in my ear to fight the infection and it's very very scary as well because I might be having surgery on my ear but once this surgery is done, hopefully we're all good hopefully this ear will stop like, leaking everything I'm really happy on that, about that but my ear was fine like like months ago but ever since I got in that pool and in the holiday where I've just come back from my ear just got worse and worse and worse because I don't think that pool was very very clean and that's just made the infection in my ear worse. But yeah, that's an update on my life, my diabetes and everything. Been in the hospital for like four days. I actually had two seizures. I had one on holiday, and then the Monday we come back, or the day after we came back from holiday, uh, I had another seizure on the Monday, Monday afternoon, Monday morning. Um, then I remember an ambulance, paramedics coming over to our house, just obviously to help me out and everything. And then they also found out something about my ear as well, got ear infection. Cost the atonement, which by the way, I'm having surgery on very, very soon. I um, don't know when, but it could happen like tomorrow, could be like next week, could be like next month, could be any time this, any time this year, any day, any year, any month, sorry. <laughs> um, I'm having surgery on that soon. I had, to, I had to have a CT scan. I was in this like, this like small compact area when there's like big like dome over me. And I was in this like, put this like thing over my head. I had to scan my head, I had to stay very, very still. And I hated it so much, I was, I was very uncomfortable. Uh, I just had to stay still. They had to do laser scans on me because I was I'm moving quite a lot. They had to do it again. And I was just very, very annoyed about that. Like, it was just, ugh. And I, I, they had to do a CT scan, they had to do MRI scans about my ear, my head. And it, it was horrible. I transferred to another hospital, I think. It was, it was, also people, the hospitals were messing around as well. They were like, they didn't know I was diabetic. They didn't know I was diabetic. And, it, and then my mum filed a complaint. And then we had this meeting the next day about like, the complaint and everything, I talked to this other guy, this head of head of NHS or something, I had to talk about him and talk talk to him and it was just it was just complicated. Yeah, it's hard having diabetes type one. I wish I didn't have it now. It's just part of who I am now, it's crazy. But yeah, we had to talk to this guy about like file my mum to file a complaint because the staff at the hospital didn't work very well, they didn't know I had diabetes and they just did, I can't remember a whole lot, but I, guys, diabetes is hard, I'm not going to lie, it is hard, I'm not going to say, oh, it's easy, it's easy, it's easy, it's not, it's hard, I, I struggle with it, and counting out, you know, carbs, whenever I have a meal, got to get the, gotta get the insulin right, got to get a blood sugar every single day, got to inject, got to inject every night as well, morning, day, got college now, we'll walk down to the bus, walk down to the bus stop, I'll catch you all later, I'll vlog a bit more, also guys, I've got a very, very exciting video on Friday, 
Can't wait for that. It's a Fortnite video. I played Fortnite with some fans yesterday. I can't wait for you guys to see that. It's amazing. Anyway. Hey guys, I'm at college right now, guys. Classroom is literally just there. And um, just English, and then at English, I've got maths. I have a maths test um, next, well, after, after English. And I'm just waiting for English now, guys. Hopefully, this lesson's good. Hopefully, I'll do well in that little maths test. I'll see you all later, guys. I'll probably talk a bit later on in the vlog. Um, hopefully, I get this video up for today or tomorrow. You'll know when the video goes up anyway. Hope you guys enjoyed the vlog so far. If you have, leave a like and subscribe. So close to 500 subscribers. It's amazing. I'm talking about diabetes, diabetes and everything. Just got off the bus, guys. Currently walking the road now to get to go home. But as soon as I get home, I'm going to turn my computer, update Fortnite, and then whilst it's updating, I'm going to go out and walk my dog. And I'll come back. I'll edit the vlog tonight. I hope I get it up for tomorrow night at 6, 6 o'clock. Uh, I'll play some fun now with some people. It's going to be great. I can't wait for that. I need to get this video edited, sorted for tomorrow. But when you're seeing this, it's already up, like, Wednesday when you're watching this.